Alright, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another episode of Project Ozone. Dudes, I know it's been a long time. It's been a freaking long time <laughs> since we played this on YouTube last. Uh, but if you missed it, we actually did a stream from here. That was It was a lot of fun. I streamed for like two hours uh, uh, from, from this world before I went on Hermitcraft the other... Well, that was also like a week ago now. Uh, but yeah, today I just woke up and I was like, oh dudes, we gotta play some project today. We gotta play some Ozone. I just want to point out, guys, I'm trying to be consistent with my series, but uh, it, it, at a point, uh, it's at a point where it gets to a point where if I don't feel up for it, I don't want to force myself in doing a video from a specific mod pack. I know a lot of people get like angry. This is my least popular series, though. Um, and I haven't like I've, I haven't not feel felt up for it, but I've been I've been feeling more up for other other mod packs and like Sprout and I've been playing a lot of Hermitcraft, like a lot of Hermitcraft lately. So yeah, just wanted to point that out. I'm not planning on like quitting any series ever, <laughs> but uh, I just quit whenever I'm out of inspiration or when I don't enjoy it anymore. And I'm not trying to, trying to be mean for those of you who are invested in a series anyway. Uh, so today, uh, to start off this episode, like like I said, we had a stream, we went to this bug dimension, which you haven't seen if you've only been watching YouTube. Soul Crystal, ooh. This is the Airbus mod um, that spawns this disgusting dimension, and it's absolutely freaking mental in here. We have quests uh, under the Theta, 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 under here. Yes, under Theta, <laughs> where we are. We had to kill uh, a Crush Room and an Antline Overlord, and we did that on the stream. We also activated the dimension, and now today, to start off, I want to find this guy, the Tarantra Broodmother. And apparently, they spawn in the subterranean savanna, which is the biome we're freaking in, dudes. Uh, this is like where I logged off as well after the stream, so I'm a little bit lucky. We gotta find a giant tree, uh, from what I read in the quest. We gotta find like a... Uh, a, a tree that has a boss inside. I don't think this is it. Like, this looks... This looks freaking tiny. No, I think it needs to be bigger than that. Uh, anyway, dudes, of course, if you if you guys are still enjoying uh, Project Awesome <laughs> sell, sell up moment of doom, may, make sure to uh, hit the like button down below and also show me some love in the comments. Oh, oh. I think we are close. You see the boss bar get up? Yeah, it gotta be around here somewhere. The world is super slow at loading in as well. Okay, the boss bar is got well. Oh, there we go. There we go. That gotta be the tree, dudes. <laughs> yeah, man. Uh, okay, let's try for this. I think this boss is fairly easy or not as not, not as hard as the Antline Overlord where we had to do like a puzzle. Yeah, look at that. There she blows. Will I one-shot her? Yep. <laughs> no, I didn't actually. Oh, I didn't. That's impressive. Okay, I gotta use my sword here, I think. Come on, bro. Come at me. Get wrecked. 600 HP. What the crap? <laughs> Get out of here. 600 HP she had. Wow. Oops. Uh, silk? Ooh. Oh, I don't know if we need that. Look at all the XP there, though. Gotta pick that up. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm eating. Okay, hold on. Let me clear my inventory. Uh, so that was a pretty freaking easy boss, man. <laughs> Everything is easy as long as we have uh, our super, uh, as long as we have our super, super crossbow. Oh, this is the thing that I, this is the reason I did the stream, by the way. We're gonna check that out today. A lot of people have been saying to me that I need to go to a, to the dimension of mining. And that's what I want to do. Tarantula egg, let's pick that garbage up as well. And I guess we'll just try and get this. Uh, and I forgot about that. Like, that that was the whole reason we did that stream. Uh, to, or, or these quests. Oh, dude. Okay, okay. I ain't got... Oh, actually. Also during the stream. If you guys remember, we found this Red Matter stuff in the last YouTube episode uh, of this series. And apparently, this makes us invul invulnerable. Check this out. Yep. Just gonna chill here and eat my bread and the stupid, disgusting freaking spiders. Uh... Guys, get, get 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 wrecked! You can't hurt me. You can you, you can't you can't hurt you can't hurt me. Okay, can't do anything to me. <laughs> so that that was actually a, a, a something that I didn't know about, but that someone told me about in the stream. So thank you so much for for letting me know. It's a very very powerful a uh, weapon or sorry armor. Anyway, uh, let's get the crap out of this dimension. We gotta go all the way back. I think it's the the portal is like twelve hundred blocks away. Uh, 1600 blocks away. Wow. Jeez. I think we're done here, though. Like, we can claim this. Claim that. And, um, 
Yeah, this is in the other dimension. That is in the, uh, uh, whatever it's called, Aether. Maybe we go there as well. Maybe this is the dimension, uh, dimension, um, uh, episode. We gotta pop this guy as well. Did I find a... Ooh, dudes, we got an extra life. Nice! We're up to four, four lives. I ain't, I ain't worried anymore. I'm invulnerable and I got my crossbow. I mean, whatever, man. <laughs> oh, he actually ran away! What?! I actually saved him! Oh, that was some pro skill! And I got my texture pack on for some reason, so he had a pirate skin. I didn't read what the what the sign said. <laughs> Can't believe that he made it! That was a that was a quick evasion there, Mr. Villager. Look at all these disgusting things here, by the way. Wasps and hornets and and then there are blizzards. There are blizzards freaking everywhere. I think that's a bug. I don't think they're supposed to be here. But yeah, look at these disgusting things that spawn. And some of them, like, they pick you up and start flying away. It's really freaking weird, man. You want to be careful if you're in if you're in this dimension. I don't actually know if we need the drops for anything. So if you guys know, like, all of these things, that freaking <laughs> tarantula leg. That's so disgusting, dudes. But if we need it for anything, then uh, please do let me know. <laughs> because I got no freaking clue. Guy, dice, guys, guys. Ooh, scorched wood. That's a cool, a cool texture. Oh, and yeah, look at this biome here. Uh, the uh, underground jungle, everything turns green. I really like this. I'd love to build something like this in, like, vanilla Minecraft. Like a cave with a jungle inside. Alright, finally here. We do move very slow, by the way. We could we could use with a speed upgrade of some sort. And also, I just realized, like, with this armor, we, don't, we no longer have night vision. Which is a little bit sucky. But, eh. Or it, it's gonna be alright. It's gonna be fine, Iskal. Thanks, dude. Uh, plus 10 luck. No, okay. Let's just get rid of all of this. Uh, what was this? Turretla Boss Trophy. It's like a t-shirt? Did it say t-shirt? It says t-shirt. Can I? Can I? Can, can, I can't do anything with it. I don't know what we need all these things for, but I got some stuff from the other bosses as well. Uh, mining crap. M uh, mining tool. Why is it so freaking loud here? What's going on in my base? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Also, what I did on the stream was I built this osmium compressor and a metallurgic infuser because I needed this glowstone ingots to repair uh, my bow or my bolts, I think. Yeah, 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 yeah. I remember now. I remember. Speaking about which, now that we have refined glowstone or glowstone ingots, we can make the most powerful things in Tinkers. Which we already like have. We, we have this broadsword and we have the we have the crossbow. I may want to redo the bolts though, because ideally we want these to be um, unbreakable. Uh, we want them to never run out of uh, 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 ammo or anything. And I think I messed this up. I can't remember. But yeah, we got two more modifiers remaining, and we have reinforced four, so we can't we can't make them unbreakable. The more uh, the more unbreakable stuff you put on it, the less chance there is to for a bolt to actually be consumed. Anyway, let's remove uh, or sorry, let's uh, let's do that for that, and then I'm gonna put these in here together with my aluminium. Yeah, maybe we should redo the bolts. I can't remember though what we how we did them. Um, and this was yeah okay. Okay, we can see refined glowstone bolt, slime fletching, and pokefenium <laughs> bolt. I remember that as well. So I think we we dipped it in pokefenium, which was if you guys remember we had to stand and dip ourselves in there to get blood, and then someone told me just put freaking rotten flesh in you stupid idiot. Uh, pokefenium. We have one. Yeah, maybe we should try and redo the bolts though. I mean we'd have to re-level them up. Um, but these can never be perfect. Like they can never ever not run out. Now, nah, you know what? Let's just do a uh, uh, refined... No, uh, obs pl plate. Obsidian obsidian plate. It's just obsidian large plate, isn't it? I always get confused because of 1.10 and 1.7. This is 1.7. Very old Minecraft at, at this point in time. I hope that they make a new version of uh, uh, Project Ozone. I think there was a hint for them to do that. Like, there was... There was something uh, uh, that I read that was like, oh, yeah, it's going to be a Project Ozone 3 one day. I really hope they do that. I would play that pack so badly. So badly. It would be so nice. Anyway, let's smelt this garbage up. I think I like Tinkers better uh, in this old version, though, with the uh, super OP crossbows and stuff. I, I freaking love being OP. I don't like having to, like, I don't, I don't want it to be hard to play it. <laughs> anyway, I can put two of these plates on the bolts. That's going to make them a little bit better. 
I think I can put two of them on. Hold on, let me try that out. So we put that there and yes. Okay, so then it gets reinforced five and then we can do one more. Then we're out of modifiers. Like we can't get more modifiers. This is maximum, maximum leveled up. But there we go. So now they will be a little bit less, a little bit longer. Very fine. So what I want to do now, dudes, uh, let's start with popping this guy. Uh, we got some soap, okay. <laughs> Freaking, did, did you did you think I stank, Project Ozone? Do, do, do you think I stink? <laughs> That's why it's giving it to me. No, you actually use that in washing machines to repair armor and stuff, but we don't really need it. Anti-venom bottle, okay. Very cool. Anyway, I want to check out this mining dimension. Uh, and I think, is there a quest for it? I don't think, I think there is, but I don't think we've unlocked it. Uh, storage. Hmm, let me have a look around here. Yeah, I'm, I can't find it. I'm pretty sure there is like a chapter for this thing. Uh, hopefully it registers though, but I don't think we are there yet, which is weird. Like we got this mining tool from doing, let me just double check again, because we got the mining tool from doing the ant line. That gave us the mining multi-tool. Um, so that feels, it feels like that should have unlocked a quest somewhere, but apparently not, or not that I can find anyway. Um, I want to do this labyrinth as well, dudes. I really want to do that. That's going to be so fun to beat that, and then we, we kind of completed that area of the of that quest. Anyway, I can't find it. So, let's try and figure this out ourselves. We need, I think this is the aroma, yeah, the aroma mod. So we, we need a portal uh, for it, and I think... We just build it like a like a nether portal and we use the tool. Oh dudes, but it's breaking. Are you freaking kidding me? Okay, uh sticky or dimension changer. How do we make this? Yeah, we gotta make one of these as well, otherwise we can't get out of there, I suppose. Let's do two. Um this leads to dimension six mining world. Okay, maybe we can just right click. What is this? Aromic hammer. Uh no freaking clue, but <laughs> but I'll make that as well. I think this is all we need. So let's try and put a portal up here in our little portal plot. We still need to design a lot of these though, dudes. I, I feel bad. I feel bad for not having done so. What what is that sound? Oh, it's the it's the aether. Oh wow. There is lag when building with these. Is that Oh, 10 is I'm an idiot. We need more. 85% of this tool is now used. Okay, please don't break on me before I can activate this portal. I don't even know how to do this. I'm just I'm just uh, winging it right now. I'm hoping that this is correct. Yeah, okay. And then do we do something like this? Uh, yeah, we did. Nice. To go through the portal, you have to sneak in it. Okay, let's try it out, dudes. Okay. Oh, we're in a cave. We're in a cave. Okay. And I didn't bring any coal. Crap, so what this is, I think this is just a copy of a vanilla Minecraft overworld. Uh, can I do... I can't remember. Can I do stone torches in this pack? I think I can. Let's try it. Boom. Boom. Yeah, it's a copy of the vanilla vanilla overworld where we can just mine. I don't know if there are more ores here. Let's do portal home. I don't know if there are more ores in this dimension uh, or anything like that. But this is a great source because Project Dawson is a sky block. We can't go mining, but here we can. And we can put up like a quarry and stuff here. And this was a suggestion, by the way, from you guys. And it should be, yeah, it's a flat world. Oh, and we can get the applied energetic stuff here. Not that we need it because we've already got it. Uh, is that diamonds? Oh, so it is, it is changed then. Yeah, diamonds can't spawn up here. Oh, dudes, this is fantastic to get, like, uh, charged quartz, uh, charged quartz and stuff. Charged surface quartz. That's what I'm trying to say. But look at this. There are diamonds everywhere. And we can get endless amounts of blocks here. This is going to be way quicker than doing, uh, oh, an artifacts mod is in this pack, so they spawn here? <laughs> Dude, this is an exploit. Okay, so we can get the art. I, I don't know if there are any good ones, though, honestly. But let's check it out. There should be... I remember this from survival stories. Yeah, there we go. Uh, healing gold amulet of noms. Yeah, I mean, I, I suppose we get we get so many artifacts for free, so these aren't really super interesting. But we could get a lot of dirt from here, for example. Like, there's no point in making a dirt farm when I can just do this. Va vein, vein mine the crap out of it. Dudes, whoever suggested this, I know it was one of the viewers. Thank you guys so much for it. Uh, did that not work? No, it, it is working. Let's, let's get some more dirt. <laughs> Shall we? I don't need a freaking dirt farm. I got the Roma dimension. Oop. That's that's another thing. We can't uh, <laughs> Like before our armor gave us health. It doesn't anymore. But yeah, look at this. Surdus quartz. So we got to take care of food. Maybe we should do that today 
Or maybe we'll do that next time. There are so many things that have changed. Anyway, let's do this chance cube. You guys know the rules. If I see a chance cube, we gotta do it. What happened? Nothing. Those are the worst ones. When you when nothing happens. There are loads of chance cubes here, though. Oh, <laughs> this is this is pretty good. I like this. If you play Pearl Total, you should okay. You should probably you should probably uh, rush getting to this stage. Ooh, that's the wasp sword. I remember that. Man infused artificial hive. Okay, I'll take it. Uh, what I was thinking as well, there are fluid cows in this pack, isn't there? I think there are. So we should be looking for some fluid cows. And let me also slay some so we get some food. Huh? All right, dudes, I went back to our base uh, because I'm going to craft up some safari nets. Yeah, these things here. Uh, we had a crap ton of gas tears. I don't know if we get that from our mob farm, um, but we can craft that. Can these stack? No, they can't. These here, we can capture mobs in them, and then they can't... Um, what am I saying now? Uh, yeah, yeah, they don't disappear. So they're like Pokemon balls. <laughs> they almost look like it. And then we got the Safari Nets, which are the single-use ones that we have got from our mob farm. I wouldn't mind... We have 15 beef so far. Yeah, I want to capture some cows. That's the idea. Capture some cows so that we can uh, uh, both breed them up here and make like a farm out of it. And I also want to see if there are fluid cows. It feels freaking OP, man. Like, this whole dimension, I didn't realize. Because it's out of grass, it's just so freaking powerful with all the passive spawns and everything. I don't know if it's night if it gets nighttime here uh, as well. That may be a thing, though. May we may want to bring some mega torches. Do I have any in here? No, I don't. Oh, there's the antlion egg. Disgusting. Okay, so, uh, yeah. Let's pop some <laughs> Let's pop some freaking chance cubes and find fluid cows. And there's one. Let's get this one first. That's another one. We may get very lucky. Ooh! Oh, dudes, yes! Okay, guys, I'm gonna show you what that is towards the end of this episode. This is a really good find. I'll show you that later. That's one of my favorite things. What are you, dude? You are an energized glowstone. Very nice. I'll take it. And this is a hooch. Ooh, isn't that like a... I think that's a fuel for something. Oh, I want to get into fluid cows now. I want to abuse these guys. Lava? Yep. Ultimate, uh, unlimited lava, and I think it says, uh, oh, it doesn't actually say in the, uh, in the safari net, which is which. So, okay, we're gonna sort them out later. Is this a, this looks like a, yeah, this is a weird one. Te tectonic petroleum. Petroleum. <laughs> what the crap? Tectonic petroleum. This stuff here. Uh, okay, what is this used for? It may not be used for anything. No, I think this is just a, this is just a fluid that, uh, uh, okay, fluid pattern work in progress. Yeah, yeah, you know what, I don't think that's used. Some of the fluids are, are like, unused, but they register in Forge, so they uh, show up in cows. Molten adamantite? Adamantite sounds good, let's have a look, what is that? Ad adamantite? Um, okay, so that's something we can farm, so that's probably gonna be used for something. I would think, but maybe not. No. Uh, okay. Well, hold on. What is what the the where is the where is the freaking gem that this makes? <laughs> it's completely useless. <laughs> you don't even have an ore, and it's completely useless. Okay, sorry, cow. You go. <laughs> you go. Get out of here. Uh, I want to capture some normal cows as well. Does these say they they say fluid cow? Okay. I just need one regular cow, I think, uh, to create a farm out of them, and maybe sheep. No. No, skip the sheep. Ooh, what are you, dude? Lubricant. <laughs> Don't say... Oh, do I need lubricant for some... <laughs> lubricant. What can I use? Oh, this is for... Oh, I think this is important. Yeah, there we go. This is for pneumatic craft. Oh, so that's a really good find. Because with pneumatic craft, like, I hate that mod. I don't want to... I don't want to... I don't want to mess with it. I don't like it at all. Look at that place. I wonder if there's any good stuff in these chests. Um, I think it's only artifact stuff. No! These are actually, actually, uh, real loot chests. Hmm. Unknown dimlets? Okay. I mean, <clears throat> we can even create a dimlet, uh, a dimlet, um, dimension. Dimensions are freaking OP, man. Uh, there's another one. We gotta check him out. We gotta take this chance cube first. Here we go. Please don't just be nothing. Oh! Come sail away, come sail away with me. That's cute. <laughs> the boats are, boats are buggy in this version of Minecraft, though. Ooh, is this? Oh, that's oil? 
Oh, dudes, okay, remember that. Remind me of that when I ask you, if I ever ask you. Honey. No, I don't think so. We don't need honey. This is glue? Okay, what, can <laughs> what the crap? There's so many- Oh, we can build stuff with it? How good is this stuff? Uh, probably Garbaccio. Yeah, one heart damage. Okay, glue block. What do we use this for? Um, uh, is it just like a cheap, cheap, cheap thing that we can- We- I- No freaking clue, dudes. We can make all of the tinker stuff with it, though. Um, hmm. But that's about it. It, it's a, it seems like a really bad, really bad choice. Let's not do that. Ooh, this guy is green. Bacterial sludge. Jeez, bacterial sludge. Okay, <laughs> it's freaking weird. I learned new things. Um, okay, so that has no use either. Even though it looked, it looks really, really cool. Now, dudes, uh, if you guys remember in uh, molten silver, yes, I'll take that. We need silver. So I'll take that for sure. Uh, if you guys remember from Foolcraft, if you saw that, I set up like a cow um, a milking machine apparatus. And that's what we're going to be doing uh, <coughs> here in Project Dawson as well. That's why I want to collect them. Do the chance cube first. All of these looks to be fluid cows. Uh oh. Ah? Ah, you thought you had me. You thought I'd move? I'm a Viking, dude. I won't ever move. Wonder if we need feathers. I remember building something and I didn't have feathers. Uh, maybe we'll capture a chicken as well, actually, whilst we're here. This place is freaking OP. Like, I don't need to do any passive mob farms. Mm. Molten Ardite? No, we don't need Ardite. Um, <laughs> that's only only used for the uh, for the old stuff. Creosote, we need that. Oh, isn't Creosote what we just made, like, in the Coke oven? Yeah, dude, that's a really good find, because that took ages to freaking make. What are you? Liquefied Emeralds? Yes, please. Now we have unlimited trades. You see, dudes, you see what I'm saying? This is good. Liquid oxygen. Oh! Okay. Okay, I think... I think that's important for when we go to the planets. Creosote, we don't need two of them. Uh, I think that's gonna be super important for when we go to the planets, dudes. Very, very important. Adamantite, we don't need. We already checked that. What are you, gold? No, energized glowstone, which I already have one off. Uh, that is a good find, though. What is this guy? Uh, glowstone fluid. Okay, so that's just regular glowstone then, I guess. We'll take it, or I'll take it. Molten mana infused metal, dudes. Like, that's even Botania stuff in here? What the crap? These are so powerful. If we automate these, they are gonna be absolutely ridiculously overpowered. Okay, out of these Safari Nets, that's fine. Let's start using the single ones. The only change is that we can't, like, uh, unpop them from this and then get the Safari Net back. But that's cool. What are you? Oh, so many adamantite. I see a, I see a chance cube over uh, there. Here we go. Oh, another one of these. Break it fast. Break this. All right. <laughs> Get wrecked. Stupid thing. Is this a spawner? No, it's a broken spawner. Okay, from... Uh, be happy, it said, by the way. <laughs> it's a broken spawner from, uh, from the Ender I.O. <coughs> stuff. Purple. Light mm. brine. No freaking clue. What is light brine? We learn together, dudes. Light brine is uh, garbaccio. We don't need it. <laughs> Didn't even have a fluid recipe. Creosote oil, another one. Like I said, uh, the creosote is going to be very useful, but we don't need two of that. Okay, what is this chance cube? Ah, most noobish death ever. Ever. Okay, okay. Nether jellyfish. Yeah, yeah. Oh, they're, they, these are magma slimes on top of bats. <laughs> Oh, that's brilliant, dude. I've seen this before, though. I think it was in Foolcraft. Scared the crap out of me. I want don't, don't kill my cow there. Don't kill my cow, please. Snipe. Snipe these dudes. Snipe them. Okay. And now we've made a mess. Yep. Almost cleaned it up. Holy crap. This was a lot of magma cubes. And I don't think... Yeah, there are more over there. Ugh. Look at all these drops, dudes. Is this freaking insane? Okay. I gotta clean my inventory, or clean, clean up the ground here as well. Oh, and I just threw in the one thing that I didn't want to throw in. Good job, Iskal. Good job, you stupid idiot. I'm just gonna walk away from this. Honestly, I'm just gonna walk away from all this garbaggio. What are you? Molten manulin. No, we don't need manulin. We're good. We're good on that front. There are loads of them here. Ardite. Uh, fairy. Ooh. Molten fairy? <laughs> Does it have wings? Oh, dudes, this looks like a good thing. Um... Is this fairy ingot extra TIC? Okay, so it's definitely 
Uh, this may be very, very good. Although it looks very girly. Uh, okay, mining speed 10.5. That doesn't sound very good. Maybe it's good for, like, draw speed or something. I'll, I'll take this dude, though. Where, where are you, Mol Molten Fairy? Thanks, man. I, I take you. Aluminum, I'm sure we're gonna need. Oh, Blazing Pyrothium, dudes. There we go. Yeah, I think I'm getting pretty happy to, uh, with my starting collection of cows. I'm collecting cows. Don't freaking, don't freaking judge me. I'll grab these pumpkins as well. That's one of the things that I don't think I've grown. Uh, like, if I can stay away from uh, from AgriCraft, if I don't have to grow things with AgriCraft, all these different seeds and stuff, I'll be happy. I don't like I don't like AgriCraft very much. I used to love it, but it's too grindy, man. And what be you? Lava. Okay. Well, I can't die. <laughs> so you try your bestest, but but I'm like invulnerable. Red matter armor is the bestest reward we've ever seen. We got this from a chance cube, didn't we? No, we got it from a loot box. Uh, from completing a quest. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, uh, let's head back home. Uh, we're gonna deal with the cows in the next episode, I've decided. That's gonna be, like, the, the focus next time to automate all of these cows. Um, for now, though, I wanna check out... I wanna show you guys this egg. This golden egg. If you haven't seen it, it's really cool. Actually, you know what? We should try this. The dimension orb. Uh, dimension changer. Can I just... Get game crash. No, we're good. Maybe. Are we good? Oh, yeah, baby. Okay, so we just get back here on top of our bedrock. I like it. I like that. Uh, okay, so let me show you this. First of all, maybe I should... I should make a collection chest for all the cows. Diamond chest. Do I have any? No. Let me make one of these bad boys. And we'll probably end up doing something over here. Uh, for the cow automation next time. So let's put all of these garbaccios in there. And the pig will just plop in here. He can he can be the lonely pig that lives in there. Don't know why I grabbed him. Like maybe maybe we want to make a pork chop farm. I don't know. Um, that's another thing that I want to do next time though. I want to deal with the uh, food situation. Because we got to get that as well. Let me drop the chicken and the cow in here as well. Maybe they can be best friends forever. There you go guys. You be, you be friendly now. But yeah this dimension is freaking OP man. Anyway, let me show you this egg. This is a really cool thing. One of my absolute favorite things from Open Blocks. I think it's from Open Blocks. Yeah, it's from Open Blocks. Um, that I really miss in modern Minecraft. It's a fun little thing. Check this out. We right, we, we, we stand on it. it, it, it I, I can't remember. I place it down. Yeah, we jump on it. Yeah, look at that. Now it starts spinning. Now it starts spinning. I'm hatching it. I'm hatching it. I'm hatching an egg. What do you think? What do you guys think this is going to happen? What do you think it's going to be? I've done this before in a YouTube video. A long time ago. You know what uh, what series then do let me know in the comments. I'll be impressed if you do And it's supposed to go up to the sky as well. Yeah, there we go. Okay. 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 It's happening. It's happening Let me take a screenshot <laughs> Oh, I forgot that it lifts up my blocks around it and Pop it Boom No, no, no. no. Oh, he's there. Yeah, there he is <laughs> Don't you die now, dude. Look at me. Look at me. It's the mini skull. Hold on. Let me pick him up. Let me pick him up. I forgot. I forgot about the fact that it broke stuff. Good thing I, I just popped it here randomly. This Garbaccio plot right here. There we go. All better. Okay. Uh, wh Where should I put this guy? I kind of need to build him a little yard. Actually, let's put him in here because he will run away. Like, he will flee. <laughs> but this is our baby, dudes. Look at him. Oh, <laughs> he's so beautiful. And if you walk up to him, he will carry you on his face. Uh, play, play, please, son, carry me on your face. Okay, maybe he's intimidated. Maybe he's like angry that I moved him here. He's like, these ain't my friends. Look at that chicken. Stupid ugly. Anyway, dudes, <laughs> that's the golden egg. We got a mini skull. I really like that. But that's going to do it for today, dudes. I hope you guys have enjoyed this episode. I hope you enjoyed the Project Ozone. Like I said, hit the like button if you, if you want to show me your love and support. Next time, we'll do the uh, fluid cows automation and probably also food. Uh, or something completely different. We'll see. But anyway, that's going to do it. Thank you so much for watching. And I'll see you in the next episode.